My name is Alexa Lauren. I'm in Prep for Prep Contingent 43. I'm 11 years old and I live in Elmhurst, Queens, and I currently attend PS58 School of Heroes. I consider myself to be a very diligent and determined person, but doing Prep for Prep online during this COVID-19 pandemic sure was overwhelming at first. But during this time at Prep, I sparked new interests, learned so many new things, and despite having to quarantine, we always made things possible online. My favorite prep classes are history, Latin, and science because we get to do group work more often. Outside of class, I love to just take a break, put on some headphones, sing, dance, and express myself in any possible way. I have to admit, prep for prep is the longest obstacle course I've gone through. Along with the significant workload, time management is an essential part of prep for prep. In the beginning, I really struggled with procrastination. I think the most difficult aspect about prep is commitment and the workload, which would be the main reason people would really start to think if it's worth it or if they should quit. I did in fact think of quitting a bit during this school year because I was just too tired of doing all the work and I would cry. But my parents always calmed me down, reminded me of my worth, and I just took a deep breath and continued. I constantly reminded myself that any unprepared were my fault for procrastinating, and I need to fix it ASAP. Prep for Prep will uncover the grittiest students, um, help them visualize the future and the opportunities they'll get. It's worth it to stay up those sleepless nights, do each and every one of their homework, and still be present in class. The solution to my struggle was finding the motivation to help me get started. My parents have also been motivating me. What motivates me is the thought that they trust me to do my best, are supporting me every step of the way, and I know they want me to succeed and give it my all. It is that thought that keeps me going, to work for the opportunities my parents weren't given. I eventually got accustomed to balancing schoolwork and prep for prep homework the longer and longer I was in the program. It helped prepare me with what I was going to learn in my public school and had prepared me for my new school too. I am proud to share I got accepted into the Nightingale Bamford School. They accentuate the idea of girl power and how we all should be noticed and celebrated. This summer, I am excited to go in person for Prep for Prep. Although it may be harder with all the transportation, I have been hankering to see all my prep friends in person. I am excited and looking forward to ending prep with a strong finish. To the high school graduates, if I was in your place right now, I'd say, Thank you, younger self, for not giving up on this. You were the reason I ended up here. And I know that when I get a career, I'll say, thanks for not giving up. You brought me here once again. Now, congratulations to all who are graduating tonight. I know you all will go far in life. Thank you, Prep, for the lifetime opportunities.